What's up watch fam? Happy Thursday and welcome to Lug to Lug. I'm Anna from Theo and Harris and today we're diving into a beautiful Tudor oyster prints. Let's do it. From navy blazer and gingham shirt at a summer wedding, to a cable knit sweater and quilted vest at a pumpkin patch, this vintage oyster cased, radium burnt Tudor is almost guaranteed to be the coolest watch on any nearby wrist. The modern Tudor lineup is jam packed with hefty cases, rather undaring color advancements, and Rolex copycats for occasions. Not to say they're poorly made, unthoughtfully designed, or unimpressive, I'm sure a Black Bay would charm the hell out of me in the metal, but vintage Tudor is another beast entirely. Tudor's earliest defining characteristic was the famous rose logo printed on its dials. The evolution of the Tudor brand can, in part, be tracked by various redesigning of that logo. From a rose encased in a shield, just like the one on this example, to the free rose, big and small, the logo symbolized the invincible union of strength, the watch's robustness, with grace, the beauty of its lines, according to Tudor. This rose in shield logo falls on some of the earliest of Tudor's dials. In 1947, Tudor began to phase out the shield, which is why most often you'll see that freestanding rose. This watch, however, is one of the few that made it out of the 50s without a redesign. If significant brand changes or rare dials are your thing, this Tudor is right up your alley. This is truly one of the most beautiful Tudors I have ever seen. I mean, its sharp lugs and strong brushed case are perfectly balanced and in harmony with the bright dial and copper patina. Typically, elements like the Dauphine hands and matte cream dial are the one defining desirable of a watch. On this Tudor, they're only the beginning. This dial features copper-aged, pointed hour markers and numerals at 12, 3, 6, and 9, a faded, blued steel second hand, burnt loom plots within a strong chapter ring, and two radium burns. Its soft yet robust appearance is matched with a top-notch automatic caliber 309. It's got the style, durability, ultimate versatility, and of course, the crown. The vintage Tudor market is on fire, and I have to say, I get it. And I could not be more excited to list this incredible Tudor oyster prints on theoandharris.com today. Don't walk, run. 